Hey guys, it's Natalie and welcome to my plan with me for the April monthly spread. This month I'm going to use this colour code designs printable and of course my April wacky holidays from once more with love plans. So this printable isn't designed as a monthly view kit, it's a weekly view kit. So here I'm just trimming it out and making sure it fits up the top there. So this is the way that you can utilise kits that you originally bought for the weekly spreads. Um, and use them in your monthly. And next I'm just going to block off the dates um, that are actually not in April. So I'm just placing this uh, purple washi down um, to fill in the boxes because the washi strips in the kit aren't actually quite as large as the boxes here in the monthly. And then at the top there, they're a bit shorter, the washi strips, so I just cut another little piece out and I'm just adding it up there just so it um, is all uniform. And I decided I didn't like that washi strip, I just liked the purple one with the smaller print. So I cut that out and just place that down. And now I'm just cutting out, measuring and then cutting out one of the full boxes to fit the Tuesday the 31st and cover that up. And I'm just putting another little bit there and trimming it with my X-Acto knife just to cover up that little sliver of white space. Next, I'm going onto the sidebar here. I'm covering the two sides with the same purple washi. This washi is from MT Masking Tape. I bought it in a pack of 20 and um, I really use, I use that washi all the time, so it was a great purchase. And now I'm just using this planner sticker from Willow Fields because this month we're having the Melbourne pl planner meetup, so I thought I'd symbolize that and make it more prominent than just in the monthly view. And then I'm using a label sticker from the Color Code Designs kit as a header, and then an ombre heart checklist to put all my planner spreads and then I'm using a full box and a half box from the kit just to cover up the rest of that space there. And now I'm just removing all my spreads and then working on the monthly view. So I'm placing my paydays down. So um, the Tuesdays I get student allowance, so I'm putting those down. And then on the Fridays every fortnight I get paid from my part-time job. And these payday stickers are from White Rose Planner Co. And I'm placing the little dollar signs also from White Rose Planner Co. on Monday because I need to report my earnings. This break end sticker is from Ruby and Rose Paper Co. It comes in a university school set and you would have seen that I've used that quite often lately. Next, I'm using some labels from the kit and placing them down on each Monday and I'm going to write down the semester weeks on them. So the second week of April is week five and it goes to week eight in the last week of April. And the second week of April is Same But Different Week and this sticker is from Caitlin and Co Plans. If you don't know what Same But Different Week is, check out the link below um, to the Facebook group, and, Facebook group and come and join us. And on the 25th is Anzac Day here in Australia, so I'm just placing the public holiday banner from Made by Alyssa and this Less We Forget sticker that came in my paper Pretty Happy Mail subscription this month. And on the side there, I placed a decorative flower from Fairy Plans. And on the 24th is the Melbourne Planner Meetup. And I've just put a Willowfield sticker there to symbolize that. And now I'm just placing down the Erin Condren stickers that came in the back of the planner to mark all the birthdays that I have this month. And on the 13th, I am just placing down a label flag sticker and a little doctor sticker from the Planner Junkie because I need to book in my influenza vaccine because that comes out on the 11th. And then on the 19th, I'm using a flag and a sticker from the Planner Junkie again 
to symbolize a doctor's appointment that I have. And on the third, I am using a little asterisk from Ali Bell Prince to symbolize that it's daylight savings ends on Thursday, on the, on the third, sorry. And there was just another Aaron Condren birthday sticker there. And on the 17th, I'm using the flag sticker because I've got a birthday celebration for one of my friends. And now I'm using the Once More With Love Wacky Holidays and I'm placing them on the corresponding dates. And I'll read through them for you. We've got April Fool's Day, Peanut Butter and Jam Day, Find a Rainbow Day, Square Root Day, Read a Roadmap Day, Twinkie Day, Beer Day, Draw a Picture of a Bird Day, Name Yourself Day, Siblings Day, 8 Track Tape Day, Big Wind Day, Scrabble Day, Dolphin Day, Rubber Eraser Day, Save the Elephant Day, Blah 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 Day, Golf Day, Garlic Day, Lookalike Day, High Five Day, Jelly Bean Day, English Language Day, Pig in a Blanket Day, DNA Day, Pretzel Day, Babe Ruth Day, Astronomy Day, Wish Day and Healing Day this month. And now I'm just filling in all of the items. And if you're interested in the Melbourne Planner Meetup, I'll leave a Facebook group link down below where you can find all the details of the meetup. And if you would like to donate, um, we are running a raffle which we will donate to the Victorian and Melbourne Women's Services, which is a cause that's quite I'm quite passionate about. Um, please contact me on either Instagram, Facebook, or my email address and um, I'll let you know how you can donate to such a great cause. And yep, just finished filling everything out and that's really the finished spread guys. Thank you so much for watching. Please like this video, subscribe to my channel and follow me on Instagram at Scribbles. I hope you have a lovely April. Till next time, bye.